I'd like to read you a poem I wrote. <clears throat> They're sometimes smelly and sometimes loud. You're not gonna like it if you do it in a crowd. Everyone from Beyonce to President Obama can admit that they fart daily and will never, ever quit. Thank you. Thank you. Seven awesome facts about farting. One, farts are caused by trapped air. All right, so before we fart, I'm sorry, before we start, my bad. Let's define a fart. It's just gas caused by trapped air. Now this can be trapped air that we've swallowed by chewing or drinking, or by gas coming into our intestines from our blood or chemical reactions in our body. So the next time you hear someone say, who farted? You can be like, nah dude, I'm just being like a balloon and trapping air. Two, smelling farts may be good for you. As gross as it sounds, maybe we should all start smelling farts a little bit more. A fart is made out of hydrogen sulfide gas and scientists say that smelling small whiffs of it here and there might reduce the risk of cancer, strokes, heart attacks, arthritis, and dementia. So when your sibling makes you smell their fart, you actually have the upper hand. Kinda? Three, holding in a fart is not dangerous. If it were dangerous, everyone in your class would be majorly ill by now. While holding in gas may cause some stomach cramps or just be generally uncomfortable, it's not doing any major damage down there. So if you're around your crush and don't feel like taking them to that part of the relationship yet, rest assured you can tuck that sucker in until you're ready to, uh, Untuck. Four, some foods affect farts. Yeah, that's right. Fart food is a thing found at your nearest fart mart. For example, drinking carbonated drinks, AKA a gassy beverage, is basically ordering a big stockpile of gas for your body. The more sulfur rich your diet is, like eating eggs, broccoli, cheese, and Brussels sprouts, the worse your farts will be. Oh, hold up. Fart Mart is gonna close in 10 minutes and I still need to buy fart soda, fart apples, and fart tarts. Five, there are ways to prevent farting. Number one. Stop being a human. Okay, since that one is impossible, there are some other things you can do if you find yourself farting a little bit more than you're comfortable with. Since a fart is essentially trapped air, you can prevent it by chewing with your mouth closed, eating slowly, and not gulping down food or liquid like a maniac. Even stuff like chewing gum and sucking on candy can cause farting since you're swallowing air more than usual. What I'm trying to say is don't suck. Air, silly, don't suck air. Six, farts are flammable. You know how in all those movies or every YouTube video from 2006, someone sticks a lighter near their butt and then farts and you see a huge flame that seems to come out of their crotch? Well, that's no movie magic. It can really happen. The methane and hydrogen from a bacteria-produced fart makes the gas itself flammable. And while I'm all about fart jokes, allow me a second of seriousness. Doing this is dangerous, so don't try it at home. Seven, everyone farts. Your crush? Yep, they fart. Your math teacher equals fart squared. Kylie Jenner, oh, oh yeah, big time farter. Everyone farts, dude. This is just a fact that we need to get comfortable with. On average, both men and women fart 14 times a day. Isn't it a relief to know that we don't have to fight for gender equality on all things? <laughs> Thanks, farting. Whether you're grossed out by it or just simply intrigued, you now know seven awesome facts about the art of the fart. Comment below if there's anything you want me to talk about next or anything you want me to read. I'm Cheyenne and you're on girl.com. Speaking of things people don't feel comfortable talking about, click the video on your left to learn some crazy facts about oral sex. And while you're in the clicking mood, hit up that video on your right to learn some awesome crazy stuff about your vagina.